When cows and other ruminants eat, their feet ferments in their stomach when digested, and a number of gases are produced, including methane. The animals expel this gas through burping. That sounds innocent enough, except that methane is a greenhouse gas and a major contributor to global warming. With an estimated 1.5 billion cows in the world, and 2 billion sheep and goats, it's a big problem, and one that climate action cannot ignore. While methane has a much lower atmospheric lifespan than carbon dioxide, around 12 years compared to thousands of years, it is a much more powerful greenhouse gas, trapping 86 times more heat than carbon dioxide over a 20-year period, and contributing strongly to global temperature rise. Globally, digestive or enteric methane emissions are equivalent to about 3.3 gigatons of carbon dioxide equivalents. Cattle account for 77% of these emissions, buffalo 13%, with smaller livestock making up the rest. So, how do we reduce enteric methane emissions? Across the world, more and more countries are including livestock-specific interventions to reach the Paris Agreement targets and sustainable development goals, limiting global temperature rise. There is a way we can increase their productivity and reduce their emissions. And that's by adopting more sustainable farming practices. We can improve ruminants' diets through better grazing management, changing pasture types, use of specific feed additives, and supplementing grazing with forage mixes. Adequate feed preparation and ration balancing provide better nutrition, in turn improving ruminant productivity and fertility. Better husbandry practices, including taking better care of animals, monitoring their health, and intervening when signs of illness occur, can also greatly increase their productivity and reduce their emissions. Improving a herd's genetic stock through selective breeding can also make a difference. Breeding animals that are better adapted to their surroundings and conditions, including climate and diseases, makes them more resilient and generally more productive. As countries have different farming practices and production systems, methods of reducing emissions vary from one territory to another and must be country-specific to be effective. Taking steps to increase production and reduce enteric methane emissions is not only beneficial to the climate but can also improve farmers' livelihoods. FAO and partners are working with countries to assess their greenhouse gas emissions and identify climate-smart actions in the livestock sector. These interventions can increase livestock productivity, improve food security and livelihoods, and reduce enteric methane emissions. They are also providing guidance to decision makers to incentivize livestock producers to adopt technology, innovation, and best practices that enhance productivity. Through sustainable livestock systems, we can support climate action that not only benefits millions of people dependent on livestock production, but our entire planet.